What's up, YouTube? Sick. Oh, uh, a little luckier. And today we're at one of the biggest shops in all of Osaka. It's called Dragon Star. I believe it's on the sixth floor of one of the shops here in uh, Den Den Town, or close to. And so, like, here's the elevator to even get here. Do you see this thing? Oh. And so, but even the even the elevator is freaking Yu-Gi-Oh. And so. This place is huge. This is like the most amount of people I think we've seen at any card shop in all of Japan. And so, uh, or all of Osaka. And so let's uh, let's check it in. We actually got permission from Dragon Star. Yes. They contacted Konami. Yes. They contacted Konami, Japan, to see if we could record here. And they said, okay, positive video, okay. Yeah. So here we go. <laughs> Look at this place. This place is huge. So like, if we want to make a Simply Unlucky card shop one day, this is what we need to see. Mm -hmm. Rows and rows of cards. It's absolutely beautiful. Magic Gathering, it's a hard fight, it's Duel Masters, Pokemon. Here's the one and only raffle. We talked about this in our other videos. Mm -hmm. And so this is where you uh, claw machine it up, right? And then you have the opportunity to get all of this beautifulness. And this beautiful man over here, Mr. Mino, is checking out, checking out the cards. Um, <laughs> so, so over here though we have the structure decks and of course all the different packs. And uh, yeah, let's keep going over there. Obviously, you can see a little check it out the dual, the dual area, the huge Yu-Gi-Oh poster in the background. So this is what happens when you're what is it? Sa satellite store? Mm -hmm. Satellite store for Konami. Look what Konami gives these guys. Huge banner over there for the card game. And the banner over here, YCS Japan. They actually host the YCS. I don't know if it's here, but they are one of the satellite stores. Mm -hmm. Look at that huge two scene anniversary poster in the background, kind of. Huge. Absolutely amazing. And then check this out. A 5D's freaking bicycle. <laughs> insane. Oh, insane. Like, just like looking at like that one more time. Like, I want to hop on it and like <laughs> ride it, but I think they'll get mad at me. Uh, <laughs> but yes. And crazy. But let's just keep going. Uh, before we show like any single cards, I want to show you guys Magic the Gathering Corner. All right, you guys. So this is the Magic the Gathering Corner. Absolutely beautiful. So check this out. First, before we even go over here, look at this magnificent piece of, I just want to say like jewelry. I mean, I don't even know. This is all the expedition lands, all of the inventions, all of the, uh, I forget what Almond Cat calls their stuff. This is the most expensive recently made magic cards, basically. Like up here, you have $350 cards and whatnot. Beautiful, beautiful. So now going this way, here's, the, here's our two employees over here doing their thing. And uh, this is just one area, by the way, of the store. This is just magic, so it's like, it's crazy. So over here, and then, we'll check this out. And um, so I just love how they kind of set up a, uh, just a different zone, you know, different feeling, different environment for magic. It's really cool. And if you can see down here, they have some booster packs, English booster packs, Saviors, Corset, and that's uh, Eventide, wow. I didn't realize I had Eventide yet. Honestly, I want to buy all that, but Magic the Gathering videos, not so much on something like it. And this is a couple of the employees here doing their thing and uh, saying hello. And um, all right, so let's check it out. This way is the kind of main corner, the Yu-Gi-Oh corner. Just look how beautiful this is. They have all the different packs over here. And then they have the White Schwartz, the Park Fight, the Yu-Gi-Oh is over here. And then real quick, I want to show you guys. This is uncut sheets of Yu-Gi-Oh right here. Absolutely beautiful. Huge Dark Magicians, I didn't even know those were worth $5 a piece. We have a lot of those, I've been giving them away, but um, those were uncut sheets, that's actually it's pretty sweet. Some decks right there. But if you come over here, some white swords again. And then our Yu-Gi-Oh side over here. And remember, this is a satellite shop for Konami, so this is like the best of the best for Japan. And so it looks like we got some starter decks, we got the new zombie deck over here, and then this is Savage Strike, I don't even know if we're allowed to buy that. I think Konami might have just given this to them for uh, videos. And that's the new Neos, right? That's the uh, Ghost, we don't get Ghost Rares anymore, but look at this, absolutely beautiful. Is that Ultimate Rare Neos card? See, like, oh my gosh, I wish the TCG would create stuff like this, you guys. This is like absolutely insane. And here's the 20th anniversary Blue Eyes. I think you get it for winning uh, different, yeah, you get it for winning something or you get it for a contest, something like that. Uh, is it a contest, I think? Yeah. Uh, and then here's the World Championship cards. You guys have seen this before. I think it's about 500 to 700 on eBay, something like that. Um, the different structure decks. What's, do you know what this says over here? Official Konami store, maybe? Yeah. Yeah. They just contacted Konami to ask if we could record. That's how like crazy 
like close they are with Konami. But here's some of the Yu-Gi-Oh product over here. Absolutely insane. And uh, let's take a look at some of this. Before that though, look at this beautiful area right here. Is this actually for sale? Or yes, it's for sale. sale. It's for sale? Yeah. Okay. And they have down here, they have the uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Duelist King Champion. <laughs> look at that, just chilling. The Millennium Puzzle itself. Absolutely incredible. And they have like Yu-Gi-Oh! ads just playing from Konami constantly. And then there's like a cutout of uh, a new dragon in the set that is in Soul Fusion. I don't know if you're right now because it's a video, but it's all good. And so let's go check out some of the Yu-Gi-Oh! cards. All right, you guys, so this is the new set of Yu-Gi-Oh! As you can see, Savage Strike. Uh, been out here for a little bit. You can see all the different prices of the cards. Very nice. Wow. So is that like a secret, secret, super secret rare over there? That one's like $40 instead of a $2 or a dollar over there. That's funny. And I'm guessing that's some sort of Boral Sword. Look at that guy. Super secret rare is $180, right? That's crazy. I don't even know how they do these prices. There's like five different rarities for each card. Absolutely incredible. I wish TCG would do that. That would be insane. So there's some different rarities. Very cool. We come over here, got our hand traps, and uh, some classic Yu-Gi-Oh cards. We got the Chaos Emperor Dragon over there. Let's see. I want to find, oh, down here we have the Anniversary Ghost Rare cards, the Dark Magician, the Blue Eyes, the Red Eyes. Very cool, you guys saw us actually make some videos for that. That was pretty sweet. And over here, you guys, we have our English corner. So if you guys can see this, this is actually very incredible. So this this is like the more valuable, classic, epic Yu-Gi-Oh cards. And it looks like most of these are in mint condition, you guys. Look at this. Blue Eyes White Dragon for 1,000, what? How much money is that? $11,000? $11,000. Why, yes. Nani? <laughs> What? <laughs> Nanny. <laughs> so, and then here's the three world uh, collection cards that came from the 2017 package. It was the Monster Born, the Alternative Dragon, and the Dark Magician Girl over there. But there's the beautiful, looks like those are mint condition Chaos Envoys. Do you see those Envoys? 110 a piece, 120 a piece. Um, what else in here? The Ultimate Blue Eyes, and condition really matters on these things. If it's mint, usually it's about 500 here in Japan. And you got the 400, you got the 300. And then, of course, the Red Eyes is over here at 2400 Absolutely beautiful. Honestly, I want to buy all those, and I want to bring them back and show you guys how pretty cards are here. But if we drop down here, look at this. This is the English. We have the English section. So if you want some English cards and you're stuck here in Japan for some reason and you just want to have English cards, even though you can't use them in tournaments here, these are your English cards. And it looks like overall they have some cool stuff, but if you kind of come down here, they actually have some Ultimate Rare Tournament cards. Um, Mm, kind of. And down here's Instant Fusion, so I was looking at that one. Ultimate Rare Instant Fusion. That's from Astral Pack, I believe. And then uh, Ghost Ogre Ultimate Rare. Is that an Ultimate Rare Ghost Ogre for $10? Uh, I might have to buy that. <laughs> is that 10 or is it 100 100 10 9 9 0 $10? Uh, no. 100 $100. Okay, never mind. $100. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay. So, it is $100. So this Dark Arms, $100? This one? Yeah. Uh, yeah, $100. Huh. Why am I so confused all of a sudden? It's okay. This is four numbers. It's four numbers? Yeah. Okay. So it's only removing one zero right now. Yeah. Interesting. But yeah, you guys, overall very cool. Japanese, or uh, English versions of the cards. That bottomless over there for, it's a super rare bottomless for 100 bucks. Wow. So very rare uh, English cards, you guys, over here. Solemn Strike over there. And of course, right there, you got your Ash Blossoms. We've talked about those before. The most popular card, basically. It's got like 10 printings here. Beautiful. And this is 300. And this over here, we got the World Championship 2017 um, package. I think that's the package that holds all three of those cards over there, the alternative and whatnot. And a Yu-Gi-Oh! promotional item. What does that say? It's a handbook. It's a handbook? Yeah. Is it for sale? No, it's not for sale. <laughs> not for sale, okay. And then as you guys see there, the uh, all three gods combined. Hecker, Hecker, Hecker I forget her name. Anyways, the beautiful angel card right there, $750.
Wow. Alright, you guys, so that was the end of our Dragon Star uh, kind of tour of their beautiful car shop here. Absolutely insane. Again, I wanted to show off the 5 d motorcycle. Like, I don't even know. Maybe I could ride that out of here or ride it back to America somehow. <laughs> That'd be epic. But yeah, you guys, so hopefully you enjoyed this video. Um, Dragon Star was a bit busy, so they weren't able to jump in the video, but they really wanted to show off the beautiful shop here. And uh, again, this is a Konami like satellite shop. So Konami's like, again, they contacted Konami to see if it was okay if we could record. So very cool of them to let us do that. And uh, so if you guys ever seen a Japanese shop like this, please post in the comments below. Let us know what you guys think of different Japanese stores. And hopefully we can bring you some more Japanese videos. And Sue, unlucky, signing in.